All right, welcome back to a, another episode, you could say. Um, so what we got going on here is I'm in my permanent ice shack. Now, for those of you that are new to ice fishing, bring these out on the lakes and you set them in one spot, you can move them around, but basically you set them up and you, you fish her all season. But uh, what I got going on here, I got the aqua view down there right now and it's down in this hole. And I'm gonna put a slip bobber, a slip bobber, and a slip bobber in that hole and pretty much just sit here kind of jig the slip bobbers with the crappie minnows on them. Um, this is what I got for crappie minnows here. Uh, these, just these little guys. That's a crappie minnow. I put some snow in there, and what you want to do with the snow is you put the snow in there so it cools down the water. Um, so then when you put your minnows in the hole from warm water to the cold water, they don't get shocked. They actually survive longer that way. So that's just a little tip for you there. Um, I'm gonna get the green light down there. I got this BioLoom, the Aquaview. I'm gonna try that again tonight, and uh, Get that thing down there. I'm gonna put it in one of the holes that I'm jigging in. Except since we're in like five, six foot of water, I'm only gonna put it just just under the ice, so the camera can pick up a little bit better light for you guys. Um, so I'm gonna get things set up the rest of the way here, get uh, get everything rigged up, and uh, get fishing. And as always, we're going fishing. Then I do have a legit rattle reel. Um, basically, what you do is you mount this to your wall. You put some string on it, and then you can set your tension here. And if a fish pulls out the line, you put this, you put line on it over your hole, and then as they pull it, it rattles. Um, the one reason I haven't hooked mine up yet, though, is because mine doesn't stick as far over the hole as it should. But I think right there it actually would work just fine. I'm gonna screw it into the wall, wrap some line on that bad boy, and put a minnow on it. And maybe we, we can catch fish. It's like a freshwater shrimp or something. This is how that light's supposed to work. Look at this. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. There's a whole bunch of them. There's like three of them. There's like these little tiny. Dude! That's how the thing's supposed to work. It calls in all them little shrimpy dealy bobs. And uh, the fish supposed to come and pluck them off. That is awesome. There's a whole bunch down there. Wow. Oh, this one's gone. All right. Look at these. Perfect eater crappie. Perfect. This is intense. Oh, there goes a rattle reel. I got him. Sweet. This is insane. Another nice eater. Get my minnow bag back too. Nope, close his mouth on me. Okay, let's get triple here. That guy's just a touch too small. I'm gonna let him go back. Fishing's going pretty well tonight. It's going pretty well. They're slamming the rattle reel. They're a little easy on a slip bobbers. Oh, right there, there's one. He hit it, but he missed it. Oh, he's still there. I'm gonna let it go down here. I'm gonna let him take it, and then I'm gonna set the hook on him. So here, there he goes, he's going down. Set the hook. There we go. So, like I was saying, um, they're a little light on the poles tonight. I think it might be because uh, I have braided on both of them. It's like a light braid. Good little eater crappie there. And uh, I think that's what's happening is they're they're liking that rattle reel over anything just because that's straight uh, straight mono or carbo carb floral carbon um, on there. There's a fish on the screen right now and he's biting it. 
He's got it bit. Barely see him. There he is. Woo, it's a nice coffee. Good eater. Oh, I can see him on the screen. Gosh, these are nice crappies. They're not thick, but they're good. There is fish down there. Let's catch one of them. There's a minnow jigging. There's a couple crappie down there. Jig the rattle reel. Jig this one. Wake him up a little bit. Come on, something's got to take something. There it is, rattle reel. And he is on. He is on. Nice crappie. Another good crappie on the rattle reel. You know, it seems, uh, I can't get that out of there. If my minnow's still alive, I can just drop that right back down there quick. They are slamming that rattle reel tonight. Let me tell you what, that is awesome. I just gave it a little jig. Whoa, set my drag back there. Nice crappie. Nice crappie. He's not a, he's not a 15 incher, but we'll take that fish any day. He's a, he's a good 10, 11 incher, maybe even a 12. So you go across the bucket. Yeah, bucket, 12 incher right there. Sweet. Oh, there's one on the rattle reel as I went to jig it. Oh, there we go. Oh, this one feels nice. Feels really nice. Oh, he's just a fighter. Just a fighter. But he is nice too. Look at that. This is insane. We're just hammering them out here, guys. There it is, rattle reel. Nice crappie. Nice crappie. Yes. All right, we wanna watch the other ones too because they come in schools. Nice crappie. Ah, there it is. Nice crappie. Nice crappie. You guys. Nice fish. All right, um, I'm gonna have to call it. That's a lot of fish to clean. It's 9.15. I don't want to stay up all night cleaning the fish. I mean, they just had a feeding frenzy. I got, I got enough there. That's enough for a bag and a meal. I guess what I can do is I'll um, leave the poles down and bring up the aqua view and pack stuff up. And uh, if I get anything in the meantime, it'll just be a plus. They're good eaters. I'll grab a handful of them here. A couple actually pretty decent fish in here I mean there's a good good lots of good lots of little decent fish or whatever I'm trying to say check that out one more time try to kind of go like this got a fish on right here as I'm wrapping up right now guys oh sometimes you gotta go for them check that out as I'm wrapping up the video catch a hog sweet ow scratch me going in anyways so that was just one more for the plus. I'm gonna wrap this pole up. Look at that. Bucket full of crappies. Um, if you got any questions on how I rig stuff up tonight, um, what I was using, usually everything's in the description. Um, if you got any questions, ask questions. Like like I always say. Um, been a lot of dislikes on the videos lately. If you guys dislike something, tell me. I will fix it. I will change it. Um, it's simple. Don't, don't dislike unless you don't like. And if you don't like, comment, tell me. Um, so check out the Instagram page, Wisconsin Fisherman. It's, um, Wisconsin underscore Fisherman. That's my Instagram. Uh, check that out. Uh, follow me there. And as always, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and we'll see you next time.